They'll be calling you a radical. They're as massive, 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 gigantic, radioactive Fukushima news out this morning. I cannot overstate how dramatic this is. We've been waiting. What is the statistical probability of 300 marine biologist departments in 778 days, Fukushima not having one study out of the Pacific as Greenpeace got bought off, as who's in the Massachusetts I got bought off. I've been arguing with these marine biologists over and over. The State Department and the CIA, the FBI, everybody's been coming to them and saying, don't release these studies, don't release these studies because you're going to put fear in the pot, the economy, the economy, the co and they've been buying it. I'm serious, I'm serious. I have the study out of Berkeley. Berkeley's a bunch of scum as Oppenheimer would spit in your face. As now we become destroyers of war. Oh boy, there's freaking Cal Berkeley, University of Oregon, Oregon State, Stanford, San Diego State. You have blood on your hands. Oh, do you have blood? Here it is. Here it is. One of the dead sea lions, as they've been freaking going at, has turned up radioactive. Right there, as I went down to songs, as Tom English is magnificent, beautiful song. What part of Fukushima do you not understand? As me and Kat, all of us, we came together. And we organized and we fought and we fought the machine as they brought in the fake freaking workers. They freaking tried to arrest me and kicked out when he let me speak when I did nothing. Here it is, right here in your face. You in denial, sickening masses. That sea lion's radioactive. Now, did it come from songs or did it come from Fukushima? Does it matter? Yeah, yeah, it came from Fukushima. The Pacific Ocean is contaminated 778 days, three, four coal meltdowns pouring into the Pacific Ocean, and you guys are in denial. As Obama raises the freaking limit, I'm going to put up a subset of videos of some artwork that I did, the history leading to Fukushima. As the artwork is, I've been working with Thomas Ackerman, we've been working coincide together on some art projects because we cannot get to the ignorant drooling masses any other way. What do we do? What do we do? It has to be the art. It has to be the Pablo Ruiz. It has to be that thought process. It has to be the Michelangelo. It has to be. This is dramatic, dramatic shift in the world. A gigantic, massive 311 is gigantic. 31111. The epic ignorance denials, I termed this po post ignorance as the epic ignorance long before this happened. You know, 10, 10, 10, as I was admitted to the hospital, 11, 11, 11, as the 311s, as this is. I cannot believe the postured and groomed of the American populace. And this is not a commentary of mine. This is not, I was working on my PhD, as you know, post ignorance, and I was using old studies trying to prove are we really as ignorant as people say? Yeah. Three years, given two months to live, 18 months of a rat and rave, this is gonna give you leukemia, then I get leukemia. You guys have watched my battle and my fight through originality, through creativity, through strength, through the fight, through knowledge, as I step back and view, but from the broader perspective, like Malay, as I read from my book over and over and over, and everybody says, oh, this guy's just a radical. Yeah, I am a fucking radical. I guess if to tell the truth's a fucking radical, I want to be a fucking radical. Because that's what we become. To tell the truth is radical. You have been so postured and groomed in your shiny coffin, back and forth in your styrofoam fucking mansion, in your fucking circle of fucking death spiral, as we become destroyers of world. And as CNN, you sickening motherfuckers, you sickening Fox News, all of the fuckers, you sit and pound the bombing in fucking Boston, over, they declare martial law, over. What a gigantic, grotesque injustice to those three beautiful people that were killed. What a grotesque injustice to the people that had their legs blown off. What an injustice is you glorify these two fucking punk-ass, pompous little weasel dicks. These punks, you glorify them. By just pounding the story over and over, trying to fearmonger your public, you yellow journalist creeps, as I've turned black and yellow journalist, you need to be in prison. As that young man put up, stop hurting people. Yeah, CNN, stop hurting people. By not reporting the fucking truth of Fukushima. Sergeant Gutta belongs in a fucking prison cell. Anderson Vanderbilt, CIA Vanderbilt, belongs in a prison cell. I'm telling you, as I've said over and over, this story is not going away. It is not going away. And you could kick in denial all you want. And that's Obama's, his mitigation, his Harvard law, his skull and crossbones upbringing is to just kick the can. He kicked the can for three years on BP till it gets all up to the Royal Supreme Court, which is not, it was a total kidnap. The Supreme Court is totally illegitimate. Not my words, Justice Byers' words. As you have no justice, we have no legal system because that was kidnapped from you too. Kick the can all you fucking want as future generations will mitigate and die. 
This will not wipe out all of humanity, but it sure will kill a lot of fucking innocent people. Millions. You think that mob killed fucking innocent fucking people? Yeah, killed three in Maine fucking You want fucking grandstand them. You do a total injustice to those three beautiful fucking people that were fucking murdered by these two punks because you pound it and pound it and pound it, yet you refuse to report the fucking sea lion is radioactive on the fucking beach. I used to, that's fucking right there at Pendleton. As my father was at Pendleton, the Semper Fi Marine marched into the desert in the Nevada Test site at ground zero. Trinity, Trinity, Trinity. Oh, there was a whole bunch of them. I like the Indian names they used to use. And they mass, they fucking mass murdered those guys. They killed him. Wow, these things are irony. They're circles. As I call it the nuclear triangle, the nuclear vagina, Russia, Japan, United States, well, Utah, right where I am. As I've been called the modern day Rachel Carson by a lot of different people, by a long time now, I'm not martyring myself for fucking anyone. This is a gigantic, gigantic, gigantic fucking story. And more to come. Stay untuned. I cannot overstate that. Do not eat anything out of the Pacific. Do not stick your toe in the... People say, oh, we need to flee Southern Cal... No, 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 no. Stay out of the Pacific. It's in the Pacific. The great Northwest, as it fucking flow over you hypocrites in Oregon, fucking... You don't care. Fucking the media, fuck, you're in denial. You just fucking... I call them air suckers. Thomas Ackerman says earth crawlers. I'm not a fucking air sucker. I fight back.